Hi everybody and welcome back to episode 15 of our Valheim playthrough. So in the previous video we built ourselves a little barn. Nice little barn here. Oh, pardon me. We sorted our materials. Obviously it needs to be bigger but right now that's all we got. Made ourselves a little cooking area. The bees were still happy, so I left them here. Even though they're, they're quite exposed to dangers. But for the moment, things are looking good. It's all quiet in our little hamlet. Uh, this isn't our forever home. I've still got to go out and build that and we'll make it all cool and shiny. But yeah, we now need to go and get more copper, and we need to get more tin, in an abundance. Uh, I want to take a forge with me. Uh, what am I doing? I want to take a forge with me. So I need six copper. I should have six copper here. Let's hope I've got six copper here. Ugh, I only got two. Yeah, I'm gonna smash this one down. It'll give me everything I need. So I want to take that to our base in the forest. It's nighttime. Might as well sleep. I want to take that to our, our mining camp so that I can actually repair our gear and stuff. Because I was getting quite annoyed that we're not getting enough stuff returning with us. So I'm thinking, I can't decide if we want to go to that outpost and start making our way towards the Elder. Or we continue on to that one. Because I haven't crafted a gathered a, I get a path for us to run through successfully. There's a lot of trees and stuff in my way, but let's go for this one. Let's just go for it, you know? The only way that this path will get made is if I actually go out and make it. Because I'm taking this thing with me, it'll be beneficial. Some good uh, travel music would be nice right now. Uh, these little trees actually just respawn all the time, so it's honestly just I'm going the wrong way. No one told me I'm going the wrong way. Dude, I still got a fresh axe here. And I have the ability to repair my axe this time. Come here, come here. Don't run away from me. You wanted to fight? Just try to speed things along a little bit. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, we are heading there. Yeah, you meet from a fire.
play too. Can be glad I can't do a 180 on the, the cart here. So this deforestation is slowing me down, but I do need more wood again. Never ending story needing wood. Half close away. That's still a fair distance. But yeah, we we're in desperate need of copper at our base. Some more tin. So try kill that guy, but you ran into the donut around me. Wasn't gonna let him do it though. We should be coming up on our outpost. There's it there. to call them something else but monkey seems af appropriate for YouTube anyway okay there's our little camp it's a fair bit away from where we actually want to be but it's fine Here, I need to grab some of the wood I threw in here. Am I able to do it? Yes, there we go. Sorted. Okay, set spawn point. Empty pockets. Let's go. So we know that we actually have to hit that way. I'm running the wrong way. Still kicking myself. But yeah. So we know that there's burial mounds over here. For more cores that we've got to get. Should be a copper node. No. Standard rock. Oh. Making friends. You're defending your elder? Yeah. Oh yes, we must also remember about the the red skeleton that's here. I don't know which mound he was at, but he's here. And we need a bit more wood. I'm 
Remember I said there's lots of copper in this, this place. Oh, here we go. We found it. I was going to say, we can't find it now. <laughs> but we did. We found it. Nice. Oh, see, there's that skate I didn't want to run into. Oh, nice damn. Haha, <laughs> there we go, I killed him. Yeah, the only reason I didn't want to run into him because he is a big guy. Yeah, so we need a place to repair. I do want it a little bit closer. Oh, need more wood. But now that he's dead, I don't worry too much about him. Almost too much time. Why is there so many skeletons right here? I'm probably next to a mound and I don't even know it. Like there's another one. There's another one. Someone's shooting arrows here. That sound that you heard? That, that, that's an arrow guy. No, I made this too big now. <laughs> Actually, more than sufficient just to build my roof. Works, that's what we needed. Uh, I don't think I've got enough to make a chest now. No, I don't. The chest is just so I can empty out my pocket. So that we can actually get started on this damn mound. Okay, put the seeds in there. There we go. Okay, now we can get started digging out this copper. I know we didn't finish the other one, but... So, I don't know what actually happened because I actually looked this up. If you dig out the perimeter of the the node right it's actually is meant to crumble when you dig under it you guys remember I tried to uh, cheat a little bit by just going around it is actually meant to uh, break I watched a few guides on YouTube about it as recent as uh, three months ago. 
And then I checked a few forums. The forums were a little bit old, but it's still meant to do it. But for some reason for me, it said no. So, very confused as to why I did that. And even the guy in the video, he didn't even do like a proper job. He just went boop, boop, boop. Made the square like I'm busy doing right now. I can't go deeper. Go deep because it's quite deep there. Let's repair. Okay, well, let's get started all the same. I wish I had the better pick though. It would do this so much quicker. Yeah, your profile can't go deeper because this area is already higher than what it's supposed to be. But it's fine. We got the outline of the copper, which is what I wanted. <laughs> he doesn't know what to do with himself because he's higher than me. It's kind of funny. for much longer if you keep standing there. Dude, you just got picked to death. Let's just do this a little bit, get our outline further advanced. See where we're working. I want to try get this whole node out. The other one we we kind of like abandoned, but this one's just a like second away. I really need more copper. And we've got to do tin as well, so. Catch 22, I suppose. Okay, that thing's broken. Let's kill this guy. Thinks he's cool that he can throw stuff at me. Where is he? Oh, he's a one star. Yeah, that's your cool. Now you're dead. But 
this is why we built this little spot next to us. I've just decided I'm going to make a little shelter with a bed because we've got all those other ones marked. Might as well just have a, a little spot for ourselves out here. We can make this like our new outpost. Oh, no. <laughs> this was not part of the... No, oh, he's going to help me. He's just volunteered. No. Oh. I didn't want him in the dark, I want him in the daytime. I wouldn't mind getting him stuck in here. It's full then. Because only I can get through that little hole. Is he going to come down? Is he going to be my friend? Friend? Yeah, ideally I want him to smash my, my node for me. Because he is a... Oh, that's not quite what I wanted. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to have to do this very quickly. Yeah, keep, keep breaking my ore, yeah. Yes, you can see he's breaking it there. Angry boy, yeah, angry. Well, you do that. Let me make you more angry. getting healed. No, I'm gonna stay. Oh! <laughs> that was not the plan. <laughs> Attendance, turned around to look at the great dark and then I got clobbered in the head. Okay, well it is night time, so let's have a nap.
I always do this. I was like, I think of this cool idea. And then it goes horribly wrong. But that's how it goes. Okay, we need to run to that spot as fast as possible. At least I can see my death marker now. Because I don't have food or clothing on me because it's all on that body. Here on. I keep running into damn trees. You know, what probably alerted them to me being here was the fact that I was crushing stuff. Uh, they've got a bit of a hearing thingy mechanic. Oh, see, that's what he did. He smashed the whole piece PC here. It's just nice. That's what I wanted. Yeah, they've got a hearing mechanic. Uh, they don't necessarily need to be like close to you. Oh, he didn't like me having my crafting bench either. Meanie. A spawn point. Let's put all the stuff back in the chest. Let's take it into the second chest. But we can now continue with our operation. We had a little bit of assistance, which is nice. Probably gonna come back here because I'm knocking on this ground, making more noise, and I can still hear him in the background. There he is. Told you to come back. I just want to be able to shoot him now. Not shoot away from him, shoot him. Not gonna lie, it's quite scary. There we go, dead troll. Oh, yeah, get your naked ass in here. Want to be mean to me like that? <laughs> Killing me, hitting me in the head. I'm just gonna go some other chest quickly. Like, ideally, I would have loved to have used him to do all my work for me, but... And you can check all the damage that he has brought to the area. Oop. Very nice time. Food's 
let's do. Keep digging, digging, digging. So I'm trying to start from the back to forward, but it's taking a bit of time. But at least we got more troll hide, which is what we needed. That totally distracted me and took us from a, a task at hand. But it was fun though. Unexpected but fun. I honestly really wish that trick would have worked. Will you just dig around it? No, oh, big brick. And it just falls down. as you can see it's quite big we still got this whole thing to dig out there's even skeleton involved <laughs> Oh, I'm not surprised that the skins involved. The mounds are right next to us. Getting a lot of stone, but I'm not getting copper. But it's also this weapon I'm using. Uh, if you have the, like the next version of it, you get so much more. And it doesn't take as long.
because like now I'm only doing like six, eight damage. Obviously, the upgraded version will be doing a lot more. This one's about to break again. There we go. Uh, one of these had bones in it. There we go. At least it doesn't cost me anything to repair my tools. Because that would suck. Yeah, he doesn't want to come here because of the fire. That is exactly why I placed it there. Okay. Should almost be... Yeah, here we go. More wood. Yeah, that's when I wish I had like a friend helping me. Like he, he, they, she, they do one side and I do the other side. This takes a fair bit of time to actually dig out a full node. I just realized the sound of the rubble crumbling. If you've played Dungeon Keeper number one, you get this cool little sound effect of that when the imps break the, the ground. And it sounds just like the rubble. Now fair playing the keeper. Even though the game is like very old, it was still a good game for its time, man. Eh? Also, I think it goes unnoticed that they used a very similar sound effect, if not the same sound effect. But then again, how many different sound effects can you make for falling rubble? Now, this is the standard stone that I'm digging out. Broken. Sorry guys, I'm trying to speed this along. We cleared all that and we only got like one piece of ore. A little bit disheartening, not gonna lie. Which makes me wish for that crumble. 
crumble trick, but it doesn't work. Yeah, I'm prepared for you guys, man. Can't prepare it this time. Okay, guys, I don't want to make the video too long, so I'm going to continue to do this. And I'm going to end the video here. Hope you enjoyed the video, and if you're enjoying the series, please, any support that you guys want to give, like hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, I would very much appreciate it. The likes and even comments drastically help the algorithm for YouTube to promote more of my channel, and I would drastically appreciate it. So with that, enjoy your day, and I shall see you guys in the next one. This is Aegis signing out.